Hey out there in Dragon Family World, Jim Shorts Fitness Guru. Got a special guest today, Sally Shorts is joining us. What's up, Sally? Uh, in your packet or your fitness calendar, uh, there's gonna be three different activities involving instructional videos by me. And Sally and I are gonna go through all of them with you. Uh, as always, we have our celery juice here. Sally, Sally is also a, a big fan of celery juice, so shout out to uh, the celery juice uh, world. Uh, the first activity we're going to show you that's on your uh, calendar is called Buzz, and it's a fun little game. It only takes two people. Actually, it takes three. The third person is the buzzer. So we're going to show you some different ways to play this game. Uh, in the middle is our little elephant, and so this is how it works. Are you ready, Sally? Mm -hmm. Okay. So when the buzzer says Buzz, Sally and I are going to try to be the person who can grab the elephant the fastest. Okay? So whenever the third person in your group says the word buzz, you can try to reach out and grab the elephant first. So you would want the third person to be the person that says buzz. Buzz. You can play to three or five. Back in the middle. Buzz. Buzz. Yeah. All right. Understand the first way. Now, to make it the PE version, we always have to, have to figure out some sort of exercise to incorporate. So now we're going to play the game in push-up position. Buzz. Yo. This is not fair. Buzz. Aha! One to one. And you can decide what you want to play too. You can always just play the fun. Thank, Thank you so much, Sally, for letting me win. I appreciate that. Buzz. Yeah. A third variation to this game, instead of push-up position, you can go into a plank. Oh, third graders know all about planking. Buzz. <laughs> all right. Buzz. Yeah. Buzz. All right, you think you understand Buzz? Yes, that's excellent. All right, second game we're gonna play today. Hold on, Ooh, it really gets me. Our second game we go. Mm, boy, it's just so refreshing, isn't it, Sally? Mm -hmm. Our second game today is a version of rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Classic game to solve a dispute. That rhyme. I'm <laughs> a poet. Poet Larry. <clears throat> Alright, we're going to show you the basic way to play. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Quick tutorial. What beats a rock? Paper. What beats a paper? Scissors. What beats scissors? A rock. Okay, catch you up to speed, parents, in case you haven't played in a while. So, we'll play a few. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. She won, good job. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. You get the idea. Now, to make it PE-ish, we're going to decide an exercise. So, let's do uh, jumping jacks. Okay? So now the loser, how many? Ten. Ten jumping jacks. So each time you lose in the battle, you do ten jumping jacks. So here we go. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Great rainy day thing since we got some rain going. Hmm. I wear a crown for a reason. Go ahead. I am a rock, paper, scissors, shoot king. I can do anything. anything. All right, get the idea. Thumbs up out there in digital world. Fantastic. Now we're going to change our game a little bit. Instead of, and we've done this at school kids, so you'll know this one. Instead of using our hands, we're going to use our bodies. So we're going to jump together. And I'll be the caller, so we're jumping at the same time. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Okay? Instead of rock, paper, and scissors, this will be rock. Ooh, my rock pops. This will be scissors. And this will be paper. Okay? So rock, scissors, and paper. You remember those? All right, Sally, you ready? So it's jump, jump, jump.
mouth and then put out what you think wins. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock and scissors. So, rock wins the crown. And that's 10 jumping jacks, right? So, boom, boom, boom. In our house, we don't let people win. Okay, so she's got to earn it. Um, <clears throat> shall we go again? Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. I am the king. Please. <laughs> and you can change the exercise. It could be burpees. Get moms and dads <laughs> and parents to do burpees. It could be crunches. It could be mountain climbers. Whatever exercises you want to do for that part. All right. I just want Sally to walk away crying now. No, she's fine. Oh. Sally's tough. Are we good with that? Yes. All right, last part of the instructional videos for this week involves a classic game of tic-tac-toe. Okay, so we had some painters tape because I've been doing some painting of the Shorts Mansion. So here is our board on the floor. Pretty easy. We all know how tic-tac-toe works. Okay. 